What's up everyone, Howler here, coach of your Delta Gligers. Today, I'm bringing you the week three battle of the BBR. We're going up against Steve, AKA Magnitude, uh, and his Milwaukee Sawsbucks. If you missed the team builder and want to see a more in-depth look at uh, the sets we're bringing to this game, we posted a team builder yesterday on the channel. Be sure to go check it out. Uh, if for a quick rundown of what, what we got, we got Choice Scarfed, Dragapult, we got Choice Banded, Diggersby, uh, Assault Vest, 4 Attacks, uh, Tentacruel. Uh, we got a lot of mons with only attacking moves. We got 4 mons with only attacking moves on this team. Uh, Tangrowth, Rocky Helmet to check the uh, Dracovish, Magmar Focus Sash uh, with 4 attacks, and a Reflect. Stealth Rocks, Cobalion. So, uh, where the heck is my controller? We got it. We're gonna lock this team in. I need to start this video off with a couple of confessions. Uh, one, uh, I uh, this is the second game in a row that I am playing late. And once this one get, uh, is over with, I'm hoping that I will feel a massive weight lifted off of my shoulders and I can try to relax for a little bit and then focus on uh, getting my week four games done on time and then I'll feel extra good. <sighs> so I'm a little feeling a little stressed out. It's been a it's been a hectic last couple days in terms of uh, trying to get all these games done and whatnot trying to get games done on days where I've been busy on top of that. Um, and the second confession is I have never seen an episode of Brooklyn Nine-Nine. Okay, here we go. Uh, the first thing I want to see is if he has Zorark on his team. He does not have Zorark on his team. Okay, so I don't have to worry about uh, any disguise uh, crap going on. Uh, so I can, that means that I can lead Dragapult very freely. Uh, which I will do. Um, he brought all four of his fire weaknesses, so Magmar is looking clean. Uh, Magmar, Magmar has the potential to, um, like, it could, if Darm is just, if Darm is just out of the way, or if it's weak enough to die to Mock Punch, like, it would have to be very, very weak at, uh, at that stage, but, um, and Dracovish also would have to be very low. It's too bad, because I could have brought, uh, I could have brought one of the sets that Gage suggested, and absolutely demolish this team with uh, with that Magmar, but that's okay. We will lead with Dragapult, and we will say good luck, have fun to Steve. <sighs> Deep breaths. Deep breaths will help me get through this. Steve! Fix your trainer card already, man! We had this issue the last time, you still haven't fixed it. Get some new clothes, get some new backgrounds. Okay, well, you got some new clothes. Darmanitan! I am a modest, scarfed Dragapult. I don't give a fuck. I'm just going for Flamethrower because switch ins to this mon do not exist. Aquaberry Darmanitan would be something. Um, so, the fire resist is Dracovish. I doubt Dracovish switches in. Scarf Dragapult, please kill! Oh, that did not kill. And, oh my god, Steve. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. He's gonna go Dracovish now? Oh my gosh, Steve, that's horrible. 
you invested to live the hit and got punished. I'm going to throw up my Reflect. Um, I This was a middle ground play, expecting Dracovish to come in. Um, he is Scarf Dracovish! Okay, um... Shit. Do I live another hit? I didn't expect him to be Scarfed. What? So, 197... How much HP? I need to know exactly how much PM, uh, HP I'm at. Um, so that did... 132 points of damage. So I might be able to live another one. And he doesn't have Hitmon on top. So I really want to get my rocks up. He doesn't have removal. Come on, Cabalion, live this. Please live. Okay, uh, we can give him that because that crit was bad. The, or, not, or not the crit, the miss. That stinks. Um, we have Reflect, we can go into... We can go into... Um, shit. Uh, why didn't I click Stealth Rocks first? That was... Oh, that was fucking stupid. We have a flex so I can go into this. Um, that was so fucking stupid. He doesn't have him on top. He has no way to get rid of hazards. I could have got rid of Darn. Um, his switch in to this is probably Manectric. Sludge Wave does the most to Manectric. Could also go Kaparaja, but again, I have Reflect. And I am Assault Vest, so I can take a hit from this for sure. This good damage. Question is, do I want to take a hit from this? Because... I could go into Dragapult, and then... Well, he knows I'm Scarf, so he could, like... Damn it, man. I'm really bummed about not getting rocks up. Tentacruel's important to keep at high health because he has both Roserade and... Um, both Roserade and the... Um, What do you do to Diggersby? I'm just going to Diggersby. As predictable as this may be, I'm just going to do it. Hyper voice, your throat sprite. You're not throat sprite. Okay, that's fine. Um, this is a free. This is a free earthquake. I should have made the double into Diggersby, because I knew Manetric was coming up. God, I'm playing like i I'm playing like such garbage. So I get rid of this thing. I basically need to this, this now only comes in... This now only comes in against Copper Raja after... Uh, after something dies, or if I get a U-turn, or if he goes into it on a U-turn for Dragapult for whatever reason. So Manetric's down. Kinda wish I had gone into Dragapult now. Take all that damage. Dracovish is here. We still have Reflect up. Um, so we're gonna bring in Tang. 
He can predict this if he wants to. He did not switch out. Okay. He does absolutely nothing. And now I think I will knock off. Try to catch Roserade coming in. If Roserade comes in, I can get rid of Black Sludge if that's what it has. And then I can go Tentacruel. Did some good damage. Knock off the Black Sludge. Good. We go Tentacruel. Um, so I can't regain health from Leech Seed. And... I feel good about just... Ice Beaming. Ice Beam, if he's not super... Excuse me. If he's not super sp spadef, then maybe Ice Beam to KOs from this range? He stayed in. I'm so mad at myself for not getting rocks up. Dazzling Green is a very interesting play. Reflect is now gone. Um, I can go for... I can go for an Ice Beam. Ice Beam is a better play than Scald if you were to switch Kabaraja in here. We at least get some damage off against Kabaraja. Oh my god, that is zero spikes. Um, do I? No, I'm just going to spin these away immediately. Because I can, if I can preserve the sash on, if I can preserve the sash on, uh, what's it called? Extra, this is going to do nothing. Spikes, extra sensory, dazzling gleam. Uh, there is no spike on the field. I can go for an ice beam and we outspeed Darm now if that wants to come in. We also outspeed, uh, we also outspeed Scarf Dracovish, which is really good. This Tentacruel is actually in a phenomenal position right now to put in work. I don't think another ice beam is going to kill, so in case he saves this thing, I'm going to go for a Scald on this turn, in case he, like, switches into Pop Raja. Now Ice Beam should kill, and we get a burn too. Another extra sensory. Oh, that crit me that time, that's fine. That is what it is. And now this should kill the Roserade. So we outspeed Darm, we outspeed, we outspeed everything, unless the Rabombi is also Scarfed. If Bombi comes in, we can, uh... If Bombi comes in, then we can Sludge Wave it and get lots of damage off. So Darm can't come in, it'll die. Dracovish doesn't get... Dracovish would still kill me with Fish's Ren, but that's... that's whatever. And if Copperaja comes in here... Copperaja comes in, I can break a potential air balloon. And if it kills Tenacruel, then Darm's going down. I got the speed boost. This has to kill. There this has to kill. I click Skull just in case he like pulls the double into Copperaja, but like it's a Darmanitan. It's not very bulky. This should absolutely kill. The speed investment on Tentacruel is paying off big time right now. Tentacruel putting in work. Tentacruel getting that thumbnail. Thumbnail Tentacruel, I'm telling you right now. Down goes Darm. Um... 
think Dracovich comes in. And it, we didn't knock off the item, so it's still... Copperaja comes in. Perfect. We can go into... We can go into our Diggers Beat after after our Tent and Curl dies here. And click Earthquake for free. We might even get a Skull Burn on this thing. Uh, no Skull Burn, that's okay. Uh, we, this thing could be Shook a Berry, but we're Choice Banded Diggers Beat, so I think we're fine. We are switching to Ribombi at this point is Magmar. Leftovers Kabaraja. Okay. I get a app the freest earthquake of my life right here. So uh Tentacruel's down, Cabalion's down, we have uh Tangrove on our end. Kabaraja probably goes down here. What do I do if Rabombi comes in on this? Probably should save this. And I could go hard into... I think I go hard into uh, Magmar. I think I go hard into Magmar. I don't let it... I don't let it set up go out of hand. Instead, Dracovish comes in. We know he will outspeed us. I'm going to save this, uh, make the obvious play into Tangrowth. And he could make a double here. Nope, he doesn't make a double. If he made a double, that's fine. I would just go hard. I would just go hard uh, uh, Magmar after that. I'm not going to make a double this time. I can knock off. What's the... I don't really see a big, huge point in me going for... Um, uh, and me knocking off the Bombi's item. Really not. It's really not important what move I click here. It's just a matter that I stay in, and I don't make a foolish double into something that Dragovich can knock out. I'll go for the knockoff just to get some like. Um, so, hmm. So he might be able to click a move that actually now kills Dragovich, or, or sorry, that kills. Um, move that kills Tangrove because I got rid of the Scarf and that means that if it's Adamant Scarf if it was Adamant Scarf then then Diggersby would outspeed it but I don't I don't think I need Diggersby to outspeed Dracovish at this point I just need Diggersby for quick attack Leech Life does that kill? No way <laughs> that's a zero and we are going to synthesis he gets HP back, but he loses about as much HP as he gets back. So I could actually go hard Magmar now. Because I know that I'm faster. There's no point in that. I don't think there's any point in that. I don't think there's a point in that. And we'll knock out this Dracovish, where Bombi's gonna be the only thing left. And I think I should, I think I should go hard Magmar. This is, just to try to preserve differential because I did take a massive loss last week. Um, yeah, 
for sure, for sure. Uh, if Magmar can 1v1 the Robombi, that would be phenomenal. If it can't, it should still get enough damage off to the point where... Um, it should still get enough damage off so that we'll, we'll click Flame Charge here to outspeed unless it goes for a Quiver Dance. Um, it should still do enough damage to where Choice Bandit Quick Attack knocks this out. And we at least win 3-0. But if Magmar can win this, then that's then that's great. Yeah, we don't need we don't need Violate to take to take hits from this. Big damage. Flame Charge Magmar coming through, and Lava Plume definitely knocks this out. Let's go, Magmar! Securing the 4-0 win for the Gligers. What a bounce-back performance! What a bounce-back performance from last week. That's huge. Such a huge win. Oh my god. Oh my god. Good game to Steve. Uh... I sincerely apologize for the missed icicle crash on turn one. Um, that was that sucked. Although Dragapult actually didn't need to hit the field for the rest of the game, so uh, I'm not sure how much it mattered in the grand scheme of things, just by how the game went. Um, but at, at certain, at, at least it cost him a, a differential point. So, biggest, um, I, Steve just, I don't know, he he didn't really make any predictions that game, other than the fact that I'd switch in Diggersby on his uh, Manectric, um, and I'm s thankfully, even though I uh, invested in speed for no reason, uh, it turns out I didn't need the speed investment on Diggersby at all, um, and I could have had the bulkier set that I originally had, um, cause if he were like Specs Hyper Voice, uh, well, if he were Specs Hyper Voice, then I can pivot into, um, then I can pivot into Dragapult, I guess. But, like I said, Dragapult should have been dead turn one. So, also Throat Spray would have been kind of scary. I don't know what set that Manectric was. As soon as I saw Hyper Voice, I was like, this thing's gonna be Throat Spray and it's gonna be able to 2 it KO my Diggersby because I'm not bulky. But thankfully it wasn't, and we just got free attacks off with uh, with Diggersby. So Diggersby picks up two kills, which is really good. Tenacruel picks up two kills. I always love when Tenacruel uh, picks up kills and puts in work because um, it is it's the best mon in draft format. <laughs> it's 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 phenomenal. I love it. Um, Dragapult doesn't get any kills. Magmar gets a kill, uh, although I think I have to give Tanacruel thumbnail because it, it took out a, it took out the Darman Chen. Yeah, he clearly forgot. I think the the one of the bigger turning points of that game was he clearly forgot that um, that uh, I got the speed boost. Well, maybe he didn't forget, but he just maybe didn't realize that I would outspeed his Darm. Uh, I don't know how much. Uh, invested in speed his Roserade was because um, it took Ice Beams from Tentacruel insanely well I think it was it, it looked to me it looked it was probably like max HP max special defense or something like that so he might not have been able to get a good read on just exactly how fast my Tentacruel was uh, just by going up against that thing 1v1 so, who knows, maybe he thought I was max special defense and didn't realize I was uh, uh, assault vest or something like that. But yeah, rapid spin, speed boost. That's why it's the best spinner in the game, because after we get the spin off, we outspeed scarfed Darmanitans. Let's go. Okay, so we are now back in uh, positives 2 and 1 plus 2. Uh, we make up a lot of what we lost last week, which is awesome. And next week, we are going to be facing Seabad and the Detroit Steel Wings. Uh, I, he's off to a pretty good start so far. He might be 3-0. I'm not positive. Uh, but that match will... You'll see that match next week. 
And if you're looking forward to it, make sure you leave a like on this video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel to keep up with all of our Draft League content. We'll see you next week.